what's up my g babies good morning good morning good morning it is what's the date lord have mercy it is friday the 23rd december 23rd and i'm at my parents house in somerville south carolina got here yesterday y'all i didn't even vlog anything from yesterday because i told y'all when my video uploaded i would be on the road and literally that's what was going on so ran into traffic had to make a few stops it just was <sighs> i made it here last night you know what i'm saying so it's good to be home i'm happy to be here it's early it's like eight in the morning because per usual i have not finished christmas shopping so me and my mom are about to get dressed <clears throat> drop my little brother off at work because my little brother adam he is 16 and he has a little job or whatever so we'll drop him off at work. Robin and Zay are gonna stay at home for the first part of the day. Me and my mom are about to get dressed and go Christmas shopping because I'm not done yet. I have all the ideas up here. I just need to execute. So we have to get the day started. And y'all look, soon as I got home, we picked Adam up from work last night. He works at Route 21. If you're in the South, I'm sure you know what that is. I don't know if it's nationwide, maybe, I'm not sure. But he bought me, <laughs> little perfumes from rue 21 this is blush actually smells really really good and if you are a millennial you know the signature scent for rue 21 is this pink ice baby so he got this is actually a really good scent so he got me this too so i'm already coming home to gifts which makes me even want to go that much harder for my people's gifts y'all the wind is whipping I'm so scared. But yeah, I'm here. We're about to start this vlog, start my day. Stay locked in, y'all. It's gonna be a great vloggy vlog. So first outfit, first fit. I have like eight outfits packed, but you know, I'm gonna overpack cause I like to have options. So this is the first option, brown sweats with a leotard brown turtleneck. I'm really feeling this one because this is gonna be a lot of moving and grooving to going on today. Cause after we finish shopping, we're going out to eat once we pick Adam up from work. And then here's another option. This like abstract art type vibe, silky button up with some, these don't let it fool you in the camera. These are some thick, 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 like me leggings. So these are the two outfit options for day one. I'm leaning towards this one cause this is just giving that, I don't know, it's giving that vibe. So I'll come back to y'all once i'm dressed okay y'all this is the only full body mirror i could find in the house real quick to show y'all the final fit option so we have the steve madden puffer jacket the monochromatic kind of sweatpants look sweatpants like i said with the leotard turtleneck top of course y'all know y'all had to have on my chain and then the steve madden sneakers and of course I have my Teflar bag to match. If I can get another video of myself in the mirror while we out and about, I will definitely show y'all. But this is a day one look. I love it. It's super cold, so it is what I need, baby. Now, let's go shopping. Y'all know the vibes when I'm home. Mom lives in a beautiful neighborhood. So pretty. Oh, it's cold, y'all. It is cold. Y'all, look at my mama. She love her bummy swag. Huh? She love it. Even though I do like this flannel she got on, but she ain't get me one. Huh? Say hi. I'm recording. <laughs> y'all know what time it is and y'all see where i'm at <laughs> the day before christmas eve i'm always last minute as hell 
but that's not what I want to talk to y'all about. I want y'all to see this line as I meet my mama. <laughs> I just really want y'all to see this line. Excuse me. So this is my mom. And that's the front of the stove. Look who it is. Hey, Zay. That was you saying, hey. <laughs> Say hey. He's so cute. He's so cute. Oh my God, y'all see Adam. That's all you got? Turn your flashlight on, bro. No. Jeez, why you got that flash on? Watch my trees. Here she come. Look at the Christmas tree. So this is one tree with the red and gold and white theme. But they so extra, y'all. They got another tree in here with blue, red, and white. We finna get robbed. Can <laughs> you shut up? This is for my vlog, so by the time it's posted, Chris is gonna be over. Make a video posted like two years later. He's so cute. Mm, that flashlight. Oh my goodness. And say hey to my vlog. Look at Robin, y'all. Hey, girl. Hey. <laughs> What's up, G babies? It is Christmas Eve. It's Christmas Eve, y'all. I'm so excited. It's getting closer and closer to Christmas. So, we did a lot of Christmas shopping yesterday. I'm sure I vlogged a little bit of it just to show y'all how bad the lines and stuff were. It was real bad. So, I still didn't make it to the mall yesterday because after we hit the little plaza by my mom's house, we went out to eat at Olive Garden. The food was chef's kiss, too. Everything was fresh. Everything was really, really good. I didn't vlog that because the cold is just making me not even want to do anything. So, this is the next day. My mom, Robin, and Zay went to Walmart. And me and Adam, my little brother, is coming with me to Northwest Mall. That is the, that is the Linux. <laughs> of my hometown like Northwest Mall is it and I have not been in years so I'm going to go there today I'm last minute Christmas shopping per usual trying to find the last person I need to find something for my mom today so I'm hoping that I get it I hope it all works out because so far y'all every gift that I wrote down in my notes to get I have found it and I found it on sale so what I had quoted for it to cost y'all see my little just, just, just come on. No, no. Oh my God. Anyway, what I had quoted for it to cost, everything was like discounted by twenty percent. One item was even discounted fifty percent. So what I thought was gonna cost me a hundred dollars only cost me fifty dollars. So see, this is what I'm saying. Sometimes last minute it gives you that anxiety and rush you need, and then sometimes it works out in your favor because when your back is against the wall. And you don't have no more options, you're gonna figure it out. Let me turn y'all around. So, yeah, we are about to. This is the last day for any last minute Christmas shopping because it's dead ass Christmas Eve. So, we're gonna do some last minute Christmas shopping. Coming back home, my mom bought us all matching pajamas, so we're supposed to be taking family pictures tonight. And then I think that's it. Me and Robin started the Best Man Final Chapters TV series that um, premiered on Peacock. December 22nd. We started it last night. They dropped all eight episodes at one time. Was not expecting that. I thought it was going to be one episode at a time, but they just said, here you go. So we got through three episodes last night before we started getting sleepy. Because if you follow me on Insta and Snapchat, you saw I had two Italian rum punches. So it had your girl feeling a little slurred. So... We got through three episodes, so we have five more to go, and it's really good so far, y'all. Watch it. I'm telling y'all, watch it. It is so good so far. So I just wanted to chime in, show y'all what I'm doing, switch the wig up. So I bought this bob wig, 
and my, my Beyonce wig. That's what I like to call it. So yeah, this is what we doing today. Just like a little abstract artwork type satin top. I know y'all can't really see what I have on these super thick leggings with my thigh high leather boots if they won't stop sliding down on me. And then I have my rich auntie fur jacket that y'all know I love and y'all seen before. If I can get my little brother to take me a little picture while we at the mall, I will do that. But I feel like I look real cute. I don't know. I don't know why I'm doing that lately, but I gotta go, y'all. I know it's about to be dumb out here. Wrap up too. It's cold as hell. So my mall, my hometown mall is in the Christmas spirit, of course. And it really still has a lot of the stores that I remember it happening. Like this Gloria jeans. But it's too cold for what I normally get from them. How cute is that? That is so cute. Just want y'all to see what's going on in my mall. I keep seeing my mall like I own it. Definitely don't. Calm down, sir. If anything, it's my mall. If it's your mall. Don't do that, bro. But you keep talking. You keep talking. <laughs> Not my mall got our own version of the selfie museum. It's the picture that selfie studios. It's so cute. And it looks real cute in there. And it looks like it's just like the selfie museum. They got different little setups. You can take your passport. Take your passport picture in there. It looks real cute. This tree is so pretty. Okay. I'm fucking with it. It is so pretty and it's gold. How did they know? So we didn't do the family pictures tonight, but we are playing Uno. This is, they can't see y'all, everybody relax. This is our favorite version of Uno. If you have never played Uno Flip, I highly recommend. It is the best. Okay, because we count up her points. So reverse is 20 points. Draw two is 50. And then the numbers are the value, the numeric value. That's 90 right there. The game is the first to 500. Per usual, Robin is winning. Right <coughs> How much points did you win on this one? 10, 20, 29. So it's going to be... 129. It's 119. 119 plus her 214 that she already has, which brings her to a total of. I won. I want everybody to realize that I won. The G is for me, T is for Trish. Oh, he got to be in it every time. The R is for Robin, A for Adam, and it was to 500. This is a family blog. And I got to 532. Pew, pew. So I won. That's why Uno Flip is my favorite game. Good morning and Merry Christmas. This is our picture that we took last year in our pajamas. About to do that again here soon y'all see i didn't get no behind the scenes footage of the pajama shoot but these are the pajamas the pictures are on my ig but this is a plan with this stupid bus it is getting on my nerves and this is me y'all see what's going on these pajamas are so cute i like these better than the traditional red and white I think this cream and black, well, red and black. I think this cream and black is super cute. We took our pictures and it was a success. Shout out to my mama for the ring light. What you want, Zay? What? what? What you want? Look at him with this bus, y'all. Look at him with this bus. Huh? What, what you want me to do with it? Zay, put it on the ground. Y'all, this. Um, you gotta put the people in the bus correctly, Zay. Y'all, Jesus Christ. Mm. 
And let me show y'all what they doing. Gambling and they got attitudes. Yes, man. Look at all this money. Hey. Oh, you're not in it? Okay. <laughs> I know y'all don't like being on camera. But as you can see, we all had on a pajajays. You are not in it. Okay, cool. You got that flashlight on, bro. I'm the only camera lover in the whole damn family, which is fine. I'm fine with that. So look, look at this boy. What you want me to do, Zay? What? First of all, you don't have the people in there right. The triangle got to be in the triangle, the hexagon in the hexagon. And see, this one is the heart. It goes in the heart. Oh, dang, can I not get it in there? There we go. Okay, now put this bus on the ground and let it go. He's so violent. Say, what? I'll be back. Zay, keep driving. You're not on it. No, I don't. Y'all, this is his bumper car. Look at him. <laughs> he gonna tear this up. What's up, what's up, G-Babies? So today is Monday, and I am currently on the way to my grandparents' house. Hopefully I don't got no chips on my lip because I definitely was munching, but Lord. I'm on the way to my, my grandparents' house right now. I definitely want to stop by and see them. I cannot come home to my mom's house and really seatbelt. I can't come home to my mom's house and not go to my grandparents house it just would not feel right on my heart if where my mom lives is buckhead for all my at aliens where my grandparents live is like conyers so it's on the outer outer skirts a good 35 40 minute drive from my mom's house so but i'm about to pull up pull up and chit chat with them for a little while i will be back okay g babies it is now Tuesday, December 27th, and I am about to hit the road to go back to Atlanta. Wanted to stay all week up until the new year, but I'm an adult. I have to continue adulting. So, but real quick, I just wanted to show you guys a few of my gifts. I'm not, some of my gifts are kind of big and heavy and just don't have time for all that. But I'm going to show you a few of my gifts. Um... Let's start with this. This is Sweet Sweat. If you don't know, if you're not following me on my other platforms yet, which you definitely should be, your girl be in the gym. I'm trying to, you know what I'm saying? I'm a thick queen. We're trying to keep it tight and right. And I wanted some Sweet Sweat. This Sweet Sweat, my bad, is a workout enhancer. So basically, put this on my arm, stomach, thighs, any area where you're just trying to get that extra sweat sweat that extra water weight off of you this is a very popular brand to get that going because i do have my arm bands i know i have my waist shaper thigh bands i have it all so i just wanted some sweet sweat sweet sweat and workout enhancer to help me get it going because i'm back in the gym when this video uploads on thursday back in the gym that night baby we're not gonna skip a beat because i don't think i ate too bad but yeah we're gonna get it back together okay and there's some other little workout gear that i'm in the process of getting as well a shout out to my little brother he got me my sweet sweat and also this is how you know you old when the type of things you start to ask for on your christmas list i wanted <laughs> an electric toothbrush so my little brother got me this as well i don't know i just been seeing the um perfect teeth girlies always talking about the electronic toothbrush and i see a million of them in target and other stores so i just wanted to try it out and you know i'm always i don't send my little brother anything too expensive to get for me 
So this was, I think, in the perfect price range. And so I'm about to crank this up soon as I get back to Atlanta. I'm so excited. My first electric toothbrush ever. So I'm excited about that. Cause you know, these are my teeth. I'm, I'm not a veneer type of girl, no shade, you know, but you know, if I have a good set of teeth, let's just take care of what I have, you know, right? And I really cannot believe my parents got me this, but y'all know I'm a hookie hottie. Y'all know I'm a hookah hottie. <laughs> I love hookah. And I don't know how you could not know that about me. So I sent this to them to be funny. I didn't really think they were going to get it. But your girl got a hookah for the house now. And it has, I don't know if you can see on the box, it has a little LED remote so it can light up. Of course, I have to get my shisha and, you know, my coals and things like that. But this is the whole setup and I'm so freaking excited about this. This is a gift that I didn't even know that I needed for real. It wasn't on my Christmas list. But this just shows, this is a gift that shows me that your family really know you for real. I received an electric blanket. And this is actually one of my favorite gifts. And I didn't even ask for this. I didn't even think about this. And I don't know how I could not have thought about this. Because to know me is to know I get cold quick. I'm always cold. My parents keep their house pretty cold year round. So I will officially be packing this every time I come home. This electric blanket will be with me. I keep my space heater on at my job, at work. Like... I like to be warm and cozy and office buildings be cold and people just be having their houses cold everywhere be cold especially right now this time of year this was a perfect gift and this just goes to show me that my parents really know me i've never had an electric blanket before i definitely have been using it since i unwrapped it on christmas day this is it right here this this is it this is it right here baby this is love right here oops so last but not least, and once again, I'm not showing y'all everything because I just don't have that type of time, but last but not least, and this is a gift that I already knew I had, but I still was so excited to open it. I'm low key becoming a sneakerhead slowly, but surely, you know, most of my sneakers are from Steve Madden because y'all know that's my man, but these were a special request and I'm so happy. Oh my God, y'all. Oh my God. I'm not a sneakerhead like that, but when I see a pair I like, I like them. So y'all, look at them. Y'all ready? Hey. I'm gonna just, I'm gonna, I'm gonna give y'all a second. I'll wait. Beautiful. Chef's kiss. Santa always, me and Santa like this. Santa, Santa fuck with me. Santa loves g Dog and g Dog loves Santa because what? <laughs> and I cannot wait to put a fit on with this. I thought I was going to put a fit on while I was here, but you know, it didn't quite happen that way. It didn't work out that way. But yes, this is one of my highlights as well as the electric blanket. So is the hookah, so is the toothbrush, everything. Like, I just love everything that I got, expected and unexpected. And yeah, Christmas 2K22 was a blessing. This year definitely ended on a high note. I'm very, 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 very optimistic about 2023. I always try to start in high hopes. 2022 is a little rocky. But you know, I have one more video. I have plans for New Year's Eve weekend. But of course, by the time I actually upload it, it'll already be 2023. So this is my last video post upload or whatever for 2022. So yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed my Christmas vlog. I showed what I could. Like I said, my people don't really like the camera like me. So I try to be respectful of that and just show what I can. And I know y'all get the gist of it. If you moved away from home and you come back home, you already know what the vibe is like when you come home. 
It's just very nostalgic. It's comforting. It's just love. Hopefully, that's how it is when everybody goes home. So, I'm wrapping it up. I'm about to pack everything up in my car. And I'm about to take this four and a half hour drive back to the ATL, shorty. And I'm a little nervous going back because I've been hearing pipes busting. The cold really got Atlanta going crazy. So, let's say a quick prayer that when I get home, everything is good to go. But, yeah. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see y'all in 2023 with my New Year's Eve vlog. Okay? Bye.